All right, so Doc Aquatic is here at IMAVL, and you guys have, have gone through some changes lately, your lineup for starters. Can you tell us who's in the band these days? It's myself, J.C. Hayes, uh, my brother who's not here. He's unfortunately working right now, Zachary Hayes on drums. I play guitar, and uh, I sing. And this is? I'm Charles, and I play bass and synth some things. Bass and synth and things. Charles Gailey. So, yeah, we're a three-piece now. We used to be a four-piece. Um... Basically, we just uh, we kind of reassessed what we were doing and um, took a break and then made an album as a three piece. Mm -hmm. And and so that the new album Tombs, which is coming out, yep. and you said another month or so. Yep. Can you tell us a little bit about what that's going to sound like? Okay, so it's it sounds like Doc Aquatic still. It's very Doc Aquaticy, um, but there's more more stuff. Um, I'd say there's more layers and texture to all the songs. Um, We've gotten more gear lately, like Moog synthesizers that we kind of, uh, you know, back up the guitar and stuff like that with Moogs and stuff like that. Um, so just more lush and kind of more atmospheric than what we've done in the past, probably. Yeah, we definitely had, like, if you've heard the last EP, that was done really, really quick at school. You just, like, get it done, so it was pretty much single-tracked everything, but this one we had time to just sit at home and spend six yeah. months and you know max out yeah, track yeah. counts and just yeah we've always recorded at recording studios like this beautiful one we're in right now <laughs> we've never recorded one. here we'd like to <laughs> uh we've always recorded up in boone north carolina um at a recording studio there and you're kind of pressed for time and uh we kind of don't work well under time pressure uh so this one we just kind of we did at our house with our home studio that we've been building um and also, we recorded drums and different stuff like bass and, and stuff like that out um, at a big log cabin out um, near Boone, North Carolina. Right. So just all recorded ourselves, and then uh, it gave us the time to actually relax and record uh, and try things out maybe that weren't written in the song, just kind of toying around that became parts in the song like they are now. Mm -hmm. um, and then we're going to get it mixed here. It's, uh, a few songs have been mixed here at Echo uh, by John Ashley, and he's doing the whole album for us. So are you going to be playing any of the new material at Bellshare? Oh, yeah. yeah, a lot of it. All, all new jams. Um, all new. Yeah, we've been well, I playing. Guess, I guess two of them are old and have, we've played before. Well, they'll be songs. on the new album. Yeah. But uh, yeah, all new songs. Yeah. We're excited every, about that. Every, everything we'll play will be on the album. Yeah. I guess except for maybe one song. Maybe one song. But yeah. yeah. Newer song. So there hasn't really been a lot of psychedelic yeah. rock at Bell Share. It's I don't know if it's just that that hasn't been what's been chosen, but yeah. do you feel like um, that psychedelic is sort of having its day right now, and that's why it's finally made it to this, the last Bell Share? Um, maybe so. I mean, we played Bell Share. This will be our third time, so uh, we might be more psychedelic now than we were when <laughs> we <you> started. <laughs> um, there's been you know the progression. Um, but I definitely think people are starting to notice uh, maybe um, it's okay to push the boundaries here and there as far as like maybe get a little noisy. Uh, you know, there's nothing more exciting than getting really noisy on Cox Avenue and just hearing it reverberate through downtown. That's going to be really fun. Um, but yeah, I think I think psychedelic rocks it's coming back maybe. Yeah. So you're playing the Cox Avenue stage Sunday at three. Is, yeah. Is that right? Mm -hmm. Great. And. Um, before uh, before you all take off, I wanted to ask if you have a, a favorite Bell Share memory. Maybe maybe just as as being there, hanging out, yeah. or a favorite band you've seen, or um, or, or playing. Doctor Dog was cool last that year. That was cool. Um, my friend, they have the uh, the hamburgers that are like two donuts with oh, a hamburger yes. <laughs> in between. Story. They this sell is a great those. Story. Um, and you know, I'm not gonna say my friend got uh, E. coli from from dropping it on the ground and during Bell Share, picking it up and eating and it, and eating like, it afterwards. But oh. uh, don't eat food off the ground at Bell Share. Is all I'll say. Probably just as a general rule. Yeah, yeah. don't Ever. don't yeah don't eat food off the ground. But <laughs> yeah, we love Bell Share. It's really fun, and we're sa we're sad that it's gonna be the last one. But we're excited that we can kind of be one of the last bands to ever play Bell Share. Yeah, yeah, that's it's a good cool. way to look at it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, thanks for coming in and, and thanks, talking Allie. to us, thanks, and, yeah. and we'll be back in a few minutes with Colston and Crazy Horse. Thanks. <laughs>